Hereford made it a trio of home wins back in the Football League by beating Sloppy Hartlepool. And the opening goal was created and scored by Tim Sills. Sills fed the ball out to Trent McClenaghan and then saw his header slip through Butterfingers keeper, Jimmy Constantopoulos. A well-worked goal from Hereford, but this was a game that infuriated Paul's boss, Danny Wilson. He called the quality of his team's defending atrocious. And it got worse in the second half when inexplicably defender Michael Nelson blocked Stuart Fleetwood when the ball was rolling back to the keeper. A penalty was awarded. It summed up another glum day for Hartlepool, who were really struggling to acclimatise to life in League Two. It was left to Rob Purdy, and he powerfully made it 2-0 with a well-taken spot kick. But then two minutes later, the visitors rallied. Effian Williams found Joel Porter, and Porter's precise pass was swept home by James Brown to make it 2-1 and game on. A well-taken goal. Brown was able to get the better of defenders Dean Beckwith, Tamika Kandawire and beat keeper Scott Tynan. The victory was confirmed for the home team 17 minutes from time. Alan Connell released Simon Travis, whose running cross was collected by Andy Williams. He made it 3-1, but Graham Turner felt that his Hereford side were lethargic after the midweek cup win over Coventry. Danny Wilson was unhappy with the quality of his team's defending. These are concerning times for Hartlepool.